to Dr. FS Club, welcome back to the channel, and welcome to an early mod preview. Actually, today, there is two early mod previews. Remember, these are early releases. This is not out yet. Who knows? But it might be out by the time you guys are watching this. What we're going to be showcasing today is two new mods from Custom Modding. So thank you to Custom Modding for allowing me to be able to show you guys an early access to these. This is the John Deere S Series Combines and the John Deere FD700 Series Hydroflex Draper. These mods are right now being tested on the mod up, so in the coming days, it will be released. Okay, first of all, before we get to the showcase, let me actually mention a few things about this mod. The Goodyear tires, Saucy, and Power Flex tracks all were made by custom modding and they are exclusive to their mods. And about the Patriot version, something they brought first and several other modders are actually using the ideal. And they said that they have no problem with that because they showed it to everyone and they knew that it would be a source of inspiration for other modders to bring it to their mods. And then the query, it was custom modding that actually got the license for it to bring it to all platforms. So with that out of the way, let's actually take a closer look at this mod. Okay, so here we go. We have two of them right now just sitting in this oat field. Let's actually take a look at these in store before we actually get into, you know, the specifics on this. So we go right over here. Let's, let's take a look at the headers first. Okay, so we had the 745 FD header, the 740 FD header, the 735 FD header, and the 730 FD header. Range all the way up from 73,500 all the way up to $101,000. 9.1 meters all the way up to 13.7 meters. And just like with anything custom modding does, it is going to be very highly detailed, just like the honeybees. Oh, yeah, let's actually, uh, let's go to the biggest one first. All right. So we got crop dividers on there, no or yes, which adds an extra $250. We got reel over, no or yes on that, which adds an extra 5,400. We have the cross auger, no or yes, which adds an extra 4,500. We got the query wind system, which either no single flow, dual flow, or no on that. So range all the way from 18,100 to 21,300, or of course, zero dollars. Then numbers got all the way from one, to nine now that is a bug right now as you see the numbers aren't appearing on there so they are actually aware of it and they are fixing it right now so there's that and if we go down over here you pretty much got the same thing the smallest one you have crop dividers yes or no you got real over no or yes but you don't got you know like the wind system and you don't got the uh cross auger uh, i think you got it for this one yes you got the wind system right there and this one actually has the cross auger so the last two do and then these ones don't so that's the john deere fd series mod that will be coming with this now the big one the john deere s series combines let's get into these okay we got the 760 all the way up to the 790 all the region from 591,567 all the way to 739,363 wow so these are actually based on world real world prices. Okay, let's actually take a look at, let, let's take a look at the biggest one because that's what probably everybody really wants to get as you know, that 790. Okay, Will Brand Firestone, uh, you got Michelin, you got John Deere, you got the ATIs, you got the Saucy Tracks, and you got Goodyear. Uh, let's see, wheel setup, you got tons of different kind of wheel setups, all wheel drive, four wheel drive, Whichever one, you got Michelin, the same thing. Uh, John Deere, you got tracks, different kind of tracks on that. You got the ATIs, which they look amazing. And then you got the Saucies, which I love the Saucies. Uh, let me go right back over here. And then you got the Goodyear, of course. Okay, now axle length, you got standard, or you got 128, 132, 136, 140, 144, 148, 152. I'm gonna run out of breath. Uh, spreaders, you got the tailboard, which is right there. You got the twin disc, you get the power cast, and then back to the tailboard. Exhaust, you got standard, or you got the Brazilian exhaust. Well, that's definitely different. Uh, model, you got the 2017 to do the 2021 version, which if you guys can see, there's beacons right there. You got the beacons on the front. Now, whenever you switch it over to the 2022 version, as you see the lights change, it's more of a newer brand. Uh, let me see. It also puts that sticker on there. I can't see what that sticker is. I think it says 75th anniversary. Uh, you also got the one in the back actually changed. Uh, tail lights, well, actually work lights changed a little bit. Uh, yeah. Okay, numbers, you got all the way from one, 
all the way up to nine. I like how they did that nine. Uh, oversized signs, no or yes. Let's see, Patriot Plot. Now this is amazing right here. Go right there. We got the USA, you got the Canada, and you got the Brazil, and you got the Austria. Let me know in the comment section below, which one would you guys pick? Also, if you guys are watching this guys and you guys are enjoying this video, hit that like button. Let's try to get over 300 likes on this video. If you guys are excited about this S series and you guys want this S series, smash that like button. All right, let's, let's get back into this. Okay, we got window tint standard. I wish we seen a lot more window tint like this because they actually give you a percentage. We have standard, we have 25%, 50%, and we got 75%. Attachers, you got standard attacher, you got rear attacher, and then back to standard. Grain tanks, you got the static, you got the static without tarp, static with tarp, uh, static plus query big top, which that looks amazing, doesn't it? Uh, foldable, the Demco CIH XL grain tank, the Demco CIH CIH XL tip up grain tank, and then DW grain tank, then back to static. So all ranging from like, let's see, 14,100 all the way up to 24,667 liters. Wow. Uh, let's see, pipe. You got the 22 foot static pipe one, pipe two, 26, 28, 28 foot static pipe plus extender, and then back to there again. And then that is it on that. And pretty much these all have the same kind of options, you know, model years, everything like that. Oversized sign, Patriot, USA, okay. Okay, so let's actually take a look at these in game now. So let me get into, of course, the Patriot one. Look at that paint job right there. It looks good, doesn't it? All right, bring this thing up. Let me get a little bit closer. Uh, yes, I heard you. Okay. Let me bring this up. Okay, let's see what we got over here. We got disable uh, straw swath. Oh, I gotta start the engine up. Uh, okay, let's start the engine up. I'll be quiet so you guys can hear it. Beautiful, isn't it? Okay, here is the interior. Nice interior. Let me start it back up so you guys can see everything light up. And turn on. Like a loading screen right there. Okay, lights. Ooh, it even has like side lights on there. Look at that. By the way, this is the 2022 version. If you guys can hear me over all the noise. Beacons. Really nice on the beacons. Okay. So let me actually turn the game sound just down a little bit. There we go. Okay, uh, let's see, disable straw swath. Okay, now let's see, we have pipe out. Unfold header, let's try to unfold it. Do you see, it? they actually put that thing there like they did with the, uh, oh, I can't even think of the headers right now. Anyways, there it is unfolding, nice unfolding animation. Uh, let me go ahead and unfold that. Horn, what does this do? Ooh, you can actually open all that. And it also opens up this side right there. Wow, look at the level of detail in there. Level of detail in there. You know, I'm actually going to turn this on for a second just so you guys can see all of it. Okay, look at everything moving. It is pretty loud. Oh, so when you turn that thing on, this thing lowers. Let me do that again. Okay, maybe not. Okay, let's enable the straw swath, see what happens. Okay. Yeah, see that everything, oh, it all opens up. And it's pretty smooth too, look how smooth it is. It's like a transformer. <laughs> Cruise control, what does this all do? Let's see. So door opens. What does this one do? I don't know what that one does. Let's go ahead and fold it all back in. All right, let's turn it all on. Oh, that looks good. So that's it with the straw on. Let's turn, let's turn that off, let's see.
There we go. Look at the textures already on the tracks. Okay, that looks amazing. See, look at the dirt on there already. And I am not using any other mods besides the easy development tools, and that's it. There is no, you know, real dirt or anything like that. Okay, so right over here, we have the older version. The, I think it's what, 2017 through 2022 version. So you see different beacon lights on it, different regular lights on it, but everything else is pretty much the same. Let me go ahead and turn that on. This is also the smaller version, the 760. So this is the cheaper version. Uh, let me see if everything opens on this one too. Yep, everything opens on this one. Ladder comes out. Uh, let's see, disable straw swath. Enable it. Okay, let me go ahead and turn this thing on. I gotta unfold the header, of course, I think. Do I? No? Need to, oh, I gotta unfold the harvester. Right, come on. Oh, you see how that actually came in? Turn that on. And there we go, look at that. Okay, so that right there, guys, was an early preview of the John Deere S series from Custom Money. Let me know what you guys think about it in the comment section below. Remember, if you guys did enjoy this early first look, a like would be appreciated. Also, if you have not subbed to the channel, make sure you guys do. We post videos every single day about Farming Simulator, one of my favorite games. Also, if you guys have not hit that notification bell, make sure you guys do. And like always, have an amazing day, farmers. I will see you guys in the next one. Peace. Wish I could say I was finally over you But that's not the truth